Hello, my name's Adrian Richards, and in this um, second video in our Body Lifter series, I'm going to be talking about the details of what uh, body lift surgery involves. So I've already given you a sort of flavour of uh, the surgery. Essentially, body lifts are used for people who have um, excess skin um, in the um, tummy area, flanks, um, and the back. And the difference between an extended uh, tummy tuck and a body lift is that in a body lift, the skin excision goes right the way through to the uh, back, so it will meet at your spine uh, or area, whereas an extended tummy tuck is just going to stop um, in this sort of region on your lateral flanks. So, first thing you need to um, consider is are you suitable for uh, surgery? And perhaps what I would advise is really to do some research, look at before and after pictures, perhaps go on forums, find out how other people have gone on with their surgery. Then you need to schedule a consultation with a surgeon who specialises in body lifts. Not all plastic surgeons will specialise in body lifts. It's quite a, a specialised procedure and you know, not all surgeons uh, perform this type of surgery. So try and find a surgeon who does specialise uh, in this um, and schedule a consultation with them. Questions it's important to uh, ask are how many of these procedures they perform, what the results are, can you see before and after pictures, you know, can you talk to someone who's had the surgery uh, before under their care and that will give you the best idea of the type of results, recovery you know, that uh, occur following this uh, procedure. You also need to think about you know, the exact type of body lift procedure, you know, where you would like your scars. Um, you, you know, we do tend to try and keep the scars quite low now so they will be concealed uh, by sort of bikinis, swimwear, underwear. Um, but you need to really talk to your surgeon about where the scars are going to be placed and where you'd like them to be placed. The other thing is, you know, are you considering uh, inner thigh lift during the procedure? This can be performed and this um, aims at lifting up that skin on the inner thighs, you know, lifting um, and treating your thigh area. You can also have liposuction of the uh, mons pubis, which is, you know, the area in the centre, you know, the hairy area of your pubic area, that can be reduced in bulk and also have uh, liposuction. So there's lots of different variations and subtleties that you really need to talk to your surgeon about. And what I would advise is really to look at lots of pictures about the different variations, discuss exactly what your surgeon's planning, where the scars are going to be, what you know, which areas are going to be treated, are you going to have a uh, pubic area treatment, you know, is it appropriate for you to have a medial thigh treatment? How much are they going to treat the lateral thigh area? Are they going to perform liposuction? And all these sort of issues are going to help you get the best results, you know, from your surgery. So I'd advise you to research it, talk to your surgeon in detail, um, and then, then you're likely to get the best procedure for you. So the more knowledge you can have before the operation, um, the more informed you can be, the more likely you are to get the result you would like from surgery. So in future videos I'm going to be talking about recovery from body lifter procedures uh, and also complications that can occur. So thanks very much for watching the video. I hope you'll be able to watch the rest in the series. If you do think you may be a candidate for um, a body lifter procedure, please contact us via our email address or alternatively, you could send us a photograph of the area you're considering having treated um, to uh, our email address and we'll be happy to give you an opinion as to the best and most appropriate treatment for you, which is going to give you the best results. Thank you very much for watching the video.